Hello Leo, here's a reading for you for the reminder of uh, January 20, 2018. Um, what do I have here? Okay, um, as the background energy, it's the energy of change, but it's a natural change. Uh, it's the life itself that changes this way. There's nothing strange in it. It's like summer after spring and spring after winter. So once there is winter and then it's summer. And this circle, this wheel, is turning and turning in a very natural way. So, so something comes in a natural way here. Um, in the center of your reading, as your main energy for these two weeks, you have seven of staffs. So, seven of wands, the energy of courage and standing your ground. Even if circumstances are not in your favor, even if some people uh, oppose you, you have the courage and the strength to be where you are and to be who you are. As the main incoming energy, energy from the outside, you have the Page of Cups. And it's definitely about emotions and being... Uh, interested in them and being uh, also a beginner uh, in something but very curious and very innocent and ready to learn what brought you here is page of coins another page another curious energy ready to uh, learn but it's far more material, it's pure earth. So everything is written here, everything is measured, weighted, uh, weighed. <laughs> uh, focus, you are focusing on worth of things, on your worth, and you know where you're standing here. And perhaps more of this is needed. Um, for you. I have this nagging energy here for some of you, that someone wants something from you. Um, what is difficult for you, your challenge, is three of staffs, which looks like uh, three of coins for me, as usually three of coins is depicted in a similar way, where three people are debating over something. Um, so something new is being born here. Something uh, new is being built uh, from the two. The two becomes the, the third thing. Um, it's uh, an energy of waiting for your ships to come, uh, to see the fruits of your labor. You may have dif difficulties with this. Perhaps you don't see uh, your situation in uh, an optimistic way. Perhaps you don't know what to expect. Or you don't think you can expect something good. Remember that always your expectations um, create your reality. In part, of course, not all of this, but in part they do. What's the answer to challenge? How to cope with it? Well, three of coins. So I guess it's about working, just working every day, being ready to... Um, cooperate with someone but most of all giving the best you have as far as your uh, work as your material in flux is concerned very s um, stable energy it's mars and capricorn so mars is expansion and capricorn is something very is very you know cardinal planning sign a uh, very consistent one so there's constant progression, constant um, expansion here. You just need to remain constant in what you do. What's your strength? The cosmos. 
uh, Cosmos, which is the world card in this deck, as you can see, Jesus is depicted here as the master of it, of the universe. It's like he knows it all. He well, he was everywhere. He experienced everything. You have wands, you have coins, you have cups and swords here. So all the elements are present. And so I, I think your, your experience is your strength. However, um, no matter how, how difficult it was, um, this is the Saturn card, card, card of uh, tough lessons, uh, life lessons. So perhaps you had these lessons, perhaps you know uh, life well enough and that's your strength here i have this feeling that you don't you don't always have to be the best in everything you don't have to be the best at once sometimes it takes time just like it takes time for the winter to to change into uh, into spring it just happens with time so some things happen with time let them happen and just do your work, especially as uh, in the position what to focus on. You have this count of coins, which is king of coins. So the mastery of the suit of coins, the mastery in the material realm. You can achieve a high level in the material realm. Uh, you can be the master of your uh, of your kingdom, very responsible, um, resourceful, but also uh, happy to share it. You can be this way and you can focus on acting like this. And you don't need to be like that, you know, in a blink of an eye. It doesn't happen like that. You start from this, you start from page of coins. And there are things you need to understand. There are the things you need to Except uh, on your way. It, it won't always be, you know, easy mm, and, and, and ready at once. So just be this uh, very pervasive, solid force presented here, like the Capricorn. Just go up and up, step by step. And you're going to achieve much this way. An additional card is the Six of Cups, which uh, people usually see as a um, the card of the past, but I don't. Well, sometimes it is. Um, it is connected with nostalgia. But what we see here is children playing, generally, uh, together with adults. So what, what it tells me is to pay attention to your everyday life. And... How do you spend your time? Are you, are you able to enjoy your life the way it is? Um, even if it's not very, you know, splendid and full of honors and, um, you know, wonderful things. Can you spend your life in, an, in, a, in a normal, common way? Is it possible for you to enjoy life? The way it is, just everyday life, everyday energy. Because this is in this everyday, in this very moment, in the present, where we create the future, where we where we become the king of coins, the master of uh, of of the realm. It's not it's no miracle. It's just work. It's everyday work, and it's enjoying uh, the place where I am and what I do and putting my heart into it. So that's the, the message for you for the reminder of January. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, check your moon sign and your rising sign if you didn't, if you haven't done so yet. And I hope I see you in readings for February very soon. Bye bye guys.